Next story. Okay, I hope you guys are not Ooh. squeamish. Right. Because if you, are squeamish, if you are squeamish about bugs, this is really going to freak you out. A Charlotte couple is suing Airtrain Airways after they snapped pictures, we're about to show them to you, uh -huh. of cockroaches coming out of air vents <laughs> and baggage compartments. <laughs> this all happened back on September 15th on a flight from Charlotte to Houston. The couple says that the flight attendants on board refused to deal with the problem. One flight attendant even allegedly put her finger to her lips to quiet down the couple while they were telling her about the bugs. <laughs> well, that couple is now suing AirTran for $100,000 for several reasons, including negligence and recklessness, an intentional infliction of emotional distress. I'm distressed even reading the story. <laughs> well, AirTran says it cannot comment on pending litigation, but it denies several of those allegations. What do you think about this? And we pose the question to you. What's the most disturbing thing that you've ever seen on an airplane? Well, speaking of the bugs, AirTran says they regularly have their planes sprayed for insects. Debugged. Debugged. Okay. Right. But here's what I want to know. So they're in flight mm -hmm. and they see cockroaches. What is the flight attendant supposed to do? Is she supposed to whip out bug spray, you no. know, in closed, con you know, quarters? No, that can't happen. And, you know, if, if everyone is, you know, freaking out, that's a bad situation on a plane. This is a really tough situation to be in. You do a, yeah, you do a stump broaching. Get your shoes off. And yeah, let's go. Back in. Uh, <laughs> what are, what are you, what is, have you ever seen anything I gross? haven't seen bugs. I, you listen, I'm, I'm usually much more offended by the passengers. You know, it's a, whether it's the, the snotty teenager sitting next to you or the used car salesman or, you know, trying oh. to sell you term life insurance. But yeah. uh, maybe this is a new plan. I'm thinking AirTran might be able to now offer for a, a small charge. You could get the no cockroach section. <laughs> Oh, oh, possibly. Man. It's like an aisle book, seat or a no, That no. should always be oh. free. That is a mandatory. No, no that's a mandatory. That, you know, $100,000, I was really surprised it was that low. I thought it was a little low for the lawsuit. Look I thought they would have You're trying to hang him no, on no, now. No, I just, I just think that. Your job as an attorney. I'm surprised that they weren't going for more. Just some ridiculous number. I mean, I, I don't want to think, know what damages yeah. they suffered. I, that's I will turn my around thing. and say, I what are your damages? I they're not going to get anything from it, but I'm just surprised they came up with a modest amount of money. They're saying that their clothes and some of the items that they had in their carry-on that was stowed was damaged and they had to throw out. I'm sure it didn't equal $100,000. Oh, how was it that? damaged? I, yeah, that, we have to go deeper yeah. into that. Yeah, I, I don't know how I feel about the lawsuit. Right. I mean, I think this is gross. I think it should definitely have been brought to the attention of everyone and, you know, so the situation could be rectified, but... A uh, hundred thousand dollar lawsuit for yeah. this couple. Cockroaches exist. Exactly. I hate to break it to you. They, and they do exist. They are around. Somebody had them in their luggage and some eggs or something. Yeah. I would just want free flights. That's, That's what all. I was saying about a hundred thousand dollars. Just Pop every the uh, yeah, a lifetime membership of Air Trend flights. There you go. Free. Here's what you guys were saying on Facebook. Well, Lynette Hughes writes, "Most disgusting for me was a dirty diaper. Oh. <laughs> a dirty diaper in the seat pocket. It pocket in front of me. Yuck." What is up with people? And Ew. John DeLoe says, let's see, dirty diapers, a used prophylactic, and a urinated oh, seat. My oh, What flights are you on? No kidding. Herman Bracano writes, the most disturbing thing I encounter on a plane are the other passengers. <laughs> yeah. He concurs with you, Bruce. <laughs> well, that's just a really nasty story. No kidding. All right.